shares, it looks like the storm is finally clearing up. Uh, the flood is gone. We're basically back to normal. There's a lot of destruction left though. For those of you who are new here and didn't see last vlog, we had a crazy flood. The pond and everything, the entire backyard was completely flooded with roaring rapids. Whoa, this is insane. And so today we're gonna go check out the aftermath. I don't know what's gonna happen with the monster in the pond. I don't know if it got washed away, if more monsters came down the river and like started laying nests in this area. I don't know what's going on. A lot of animals got relocated. We saw a squirrel that was in distress last vlog. And right now I'm actually looking down at the pond and I can see some sort of animal. If you look closely, there's some sort of animal back in that section. It looks like it might be a fox or something. I think, oh, it's moving. Oh, it's laying down. <gasps> Shares, I think the animal down there is either a monster or a fox or something. It looks like it got wiped out of its home and that it doesn't have a home to go to, so it's trying to make its own home. I don't know, but let's sneak up on it quietly so we can get a closer look. Yeah, I don't know what, I don't know what kind of animal it is. Um, where is baby Otter, by the way? Shares, Otter's not feeling very well. He's been laying in the house all day long. Otter? Where is baby Otter? Otter, where are you? Otter? Otter? Huh. Oh no, the door was left open. Uh-oh, Otter must have gone outside. And that animal's down by the pond. Otter? Otter? I don't want to be too loud because I want to sneak up on this animal and see what it is. But I don't know where Otter is. I hope you didn't go after that animal. Otter, there you are. Otter, there you are. Baby Otter, what are you doing? Otter, you feeling okay? What's wrong? Are you feeling okay? Say hi to the shares. What's wrong, baby? You're not feeling good today, are you? No. It's okay, baby, it's okay. Yeah, shares, I'm not sure why Otter's not feeling well. He's a little sick today, but at least he's outside. That's a good sign. Okay, let's go sneak up over top of the pond. Look down at the pond is the first thing you always wanna look at. I see a lot of koi fish, which is a good sign. Always a good sign if there's koi fish. That means the monster's probably not around. But the real question is we want to sneak up to those bushes over there as quietly as we can so we can get an idea of what kind of animal is in there. So let's start sneaking up. I don't know what kind of animal is going to be in there and I hope it didn't leave yet but if we're too loud it'll get scared and run away for sure. I don't know how we can get over there. There's really no place to hide and we got to somehow make it over there without it seeing us and being as quiet as we can so we don't scare it. Let's just walk quietly over there. Oh, I know what I'll do. I'll go this way, I'll hide in the woods there, and then I'll peek left. And hopefully we can make it over there without that animal seeing us. Okay. Actually, I don't even see it right now. I hope it didn't already see me. Oh, 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 I see it, I see it. I see it, I'm not sure what kind of monster animal that is, but it's right there, share his comment right now if you can see that. I don't think it sees me yet, but I'm gonna keep going this way. Pretending like I'm not even trying to look at it. And hopefully it doesn't see me. Darn, I don't know why I'm wearing red. Red's like the brightest color you could possibly wear. I need to be wearing like camo or something. Okay, we're making it into the woods. Let's see what's going on. Oh wow, speaking of woods, shares these woods yesterday didn't even look like this. There was water all the way up to here. And check this out. We have like a muddy river in our backyard now. It's almost about to touch the pond. Yeah, that's what the river looked like yesterday. So a lot of it has dried up. It's gone back to normal. I can't believe that's even what it used to look like. I'm also wondering what kind of stuff got washed up. Like, look at this huge log. It's got a bolt in it. Like, what is this? I don't know how that got here, but it must have got washed up as well. Uh, there's a beach ball over there. I'm sure there's probably like hidden treasure somewhere. Shares, this literally was all underwater. That's why it's so wet right now. This is crazy. Ooh, I also wonder if that turtle's still in the water. So the other day, I was in the woods, and I saw this crazy prehistoric monster-looking turtle, and it was right over here in this section here. So I'm wondering if it's still there. But my guess is it probably got swept away in that flood. Let's cross the river. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's see, it was right here, but I definitely don't see it today. No, Shares, look, it looks like its home got completely washed out. Yeah, I don't think that turtle's gonna be in here. It probably got pushed really far down the stream. It's probably way down there. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. 
no, never mind, false alarm. But Shara's right over there is where that monster is that I'm trying to catch. So let's continue and let's see what this monster is. I'm wondering if it's a fox, I'm wondering if it's some type of monster, or if it, maybe it's a baby deer that's missing from its mom. I really don't know. I only got a tiny little glimpse of it. So, I mean, it could be anything. I really don't know what it's gonna be, but I hope it's still there by the time. Actually, how am I gonna get over there? It's literally right around the corner there. And if I go right there, I might scare it and I'll run away. So maybe I should cross over this way. This is what I'll do. I'll cross over the creek this way so that I can get a better approach. Although I feel like it's just gonna get scared either way. But there's only one way to find out. Yeah, let's cross the river again this way. This will be a better idea. Ooh. Okay, cross, cross, cross. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, and there's some type of mysterious monster looking home and that's a deep, deep hole. Oh, okay. Hang on, Shares, we're really close. We're really close to this animal's hideout right now. Oh, look at all this. This was all underwater too. All of this, basically all to there was all underwater. So all this stuff is like fresh leaves, fresh moisture. And we are super close to the monster's home. Okay, here we go. Sneak preview, spy shot. Let's see, where is it? Oh, 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 oh. I see movement. Share is right in that bush is the animal. I don't know what it is. But let's get behind this tree. Quietly, quietly, quietly. Sneak up. I'm being super quiet right now. I don't want it to hear us. Oh, 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 it's sleeping. It's literally sleeping, I'm not even joking. It's literally sleeping. Shares, look at that, what is that baby? It's a baby something. Oh, it's so cute. I think it's cute, but it could be vicious and it could be a monster, but I don't know. Here we go, closer look. Oh, 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 oh. it saw me, it saw me. It saw me, oh, it saw me. It saw me. Look, there it is, Shares. Comment right now what this thing is. I don't know what it is. What is that thing? Okay, it definitely sees me. We're looking at each other eye to eye right now. I'm hoping that it's tired. And that it's just gonna go back to bed and stay there so I can get a closer look. Whatever it has, it has really good hearing because I barely touched these leaves. And it was able to hear that and its head peaked up like that. All right, I'm just gonna keep walking. Oh, 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 and it's gone. No, it left. No. Shares, I scared it. I don't know what it was. I think whatever it was, it was a baby. I don't know what kind of baby it was. <gasps> but yeah, I think it must have got, this home must have got washed out. Because look, that's where he was trying to make a home, in that den right there. Oh, I don't know what kind of animal that was, Shares. Was that the pond monster? Was it a fox? Was it a deer? I don't even know. <gasps> that's literally its den right there, though. We are so close. <gasps> that just got me thinking. We could set up that hidden security camera, stick it here, and then at night when that thing comes back, we'll get a clear vision of what that monster is. Let me just do a little bit more looking. Let's see. So it went back in there when it ran away. I don't know if it ran away or if it's just hiding on the other side of the bush, but I don't see it right now. You know what, that animal monster is definitely gonna be back. In the meantime though, let's look for some clues about anything that could have washed up, because Shares, like I said, um, Yesterday, this exact spot where I was standing was completely underwater. It's a river back here. Whoa, this is insane. I don't understand how it was so flooded yesterday and yet so dry today. But uh, yeah, we had the craziest storm ever. A lot of stuff got washed up. Like, look at this. I don't know what this is, but this could be a sign. We got like some green muck. I don't want to touch that with my fingers in case it's toxic. Let's get a little sample of this. Ew, what is this? Shares, this looks like some toxic waste. Shares, what is this kind of stuff? It looks so weird. I don't know what that is, but that could be some sort of monster type of slime. I don't even know. Something got washed up and that's one of our clues. Let's keep moving. Let's retrace our steps. Let's go in the woods. Oh wow, Shares, look at all this. This is such mass destruction. Oh, Shares, this makes sense. Look at this. This isn't just a random pile of sticks and leaves. This pile of sticks and stuff, this is super familiar. This is 
part of the turtle's home. It used to be way in the ground over there, but the water rose so much that it shoved it over here and it got stuck on these trees. So there could still be something living in here. I'm not sure I really want to open this up and find out, um, but we can probably find some other clues. Yeah, I don't know if I want to explore in there. That's a little scary. Let's go down here. The monster's home definitely got moved. The monster must have got relocated somewhere. I don't think it's living up there and I don't think it's living in there. So maybe it had to go farther downstream and that's where it was hiding in the bushes earlier. I'm not really sure. And also, what is this? Is that a rock or like a lantern type thing? That's a really weird looking rock if that's a rock. I don't know what that is. Now I'm just on the hunt for like some footprints or yeah, actually some big footprints. Check this out. Across the river, check that out. What kind of footprint is that? Whoa, and there's another one there and there. Okay, wow, these footprints are a lot bigger. These footprints are basically in the same area where I saw footprints last time. That's from me, so that's my shoe footprint. But the last time I saw footprints, I was basically right over here. So these are in a similar area, but these are way bigger than last time. That is a big type of claw. That's big too, that's probably the biggest. And it looks like it has one, two, three, four, five. Five like claw fang things in a circle. So maybe like a big paw with like claws. And it climbs, I guess somehow it went Probably started from in the water. Maybe it got washed up. This river was flooded too, so I'm thinking maybe it was getting, the monster was getting pushed down here and it caught ground right here and it clawed its way up over here. And then, oh, look at this. There's a clear path to that nest. There's a clear path. The bushes are pushed down like the monster was slithering up. And then it came all the way. And look at this, there's like a clear path clear path up into the bushes there, which on the other side of those bushes is where that monster was sleeping today. So I'm, oh yeah, and look at this. Look at this. So I was right, look, more footprints all the way in there. So Sharers, there's something back in this section. I'm not sure I want to straight approach this section because those are huge footprints. Maybe what we saw was just a baby monster and there's actually like the mama monster back there. I don't know what's going on. But the good news is we do know that there's something back there. So let's go get that security camera and let's go mount that thing. Because before we go into that monster den over there, I want to get as much information as I can so uh, we don't run into any uh, issues. I don't know if that could be a big monster back there or what. I don't know what the size of this monster looks like. But we do know something's back there because we saw something. We also saw the footprints. I think something got relocated. I think some monster from a bigger area got swept down in that major flood yesterday and got relocated and found comfort in this new nest area. Yeah, sure. I think we have something really big on our hands. What we saw earlier might have just been a, a baby and maybe the mother monster has like a lot of kids because those footprints did not match that tiny little animal that we saw earlier. So, uh... Let's run and grab that camera and let's set that thing up. I think we have a big monster on our hands. Way bigger than expected. We're gonna need the help of Carter and the rest of the Sheriff fam to get this thing. Oh, this is gonna be crazy. Let's open the garage. Let's get some security camera footage. Yeah, Sheriff, this monster might be so big that we might have to bring out the monster attack vehicle. Yeah, check this thing out. It has three giant lights. And these aren't just any lights. These lights are so bright, they are super blinding. And it also has this giant hook on the front. So if we needed to, we could pull this hook out and like tie the monster to it and keep it like latched down just in case it got like super dangerous or something like that. If you think we should whip out this monster attack vehicle, comment right now, hashtag monster. We have our camouflage security camera that we're gonna set up. We're gonna tie it to a tree and it's gonna capture all the footage so we can see when that baby monster comes back. And when that baby comes back, there's a high chance that the parents will be there too. So we'll be able to see how big the monster's parents are. Which I have a feeling, judging by those footprints, the parents of this monster are going to be ginormous. Okay, let's get this camera set up in a good spot and ready to record. And Shares, I'm so close to the monster's den. It's literally right there. I'm gonna put the camera. Hopefully this isn't part of the monster's den. It kind of looks like it could be. But uh, yeah, let's just put it down quick. 
The good news is that the monster comes out, there's at least a little bit of a creek that it has to cross first. Giving me a little time to run away. So let's see, let's put the camera like, hmm, where do we want to put this? <gasps> oh, Cher, speaking of being down here, it's literally, I just saw it go right behind, it's literally right there. The, the monster thing is literally right there. I'm not even joking. I saw it try to come back right as we were setting up the camera. Literally right as we were setting up the camera, the monster came back. It's ready. This must be its new home. Shares, I really think this is the monster's new home. Once I set up the security camera, I'm gonna go hide and we're gonna come back. We're gonna get all this great footage. It's going to be so epic. Okay, quick, quick, quick. Let's get this camera, turn it on. Turn this camera on, come on. I'll let the secret camera record. I can't wait to capture all this epic footage. I'll check back in with you in tomorrow's vlog. If you haven't already, what are you doing? Hit that subscribe button. Join the best family on YouTube, the Share Fam, and turn on post notifications so you get notified as soon as the next Monster and Pond video goes live. And shares, I can't wait to unveil what we capture. I think we're gonna get some good stuff. So until next vlog, you know what to do. Stay awesome and share the love. Peace. Woo!